things look a little different. Some things are a bit different than how they are supposed to be. But I'm still a fan of the TV show right now. And anything that's got Boyd Crowder in it, I'm a big fan of. All right, here we go. The show looks great. I will say that. I'm telling you, joining Skinny Malone's crew was the best decision we've ever made. Look at this place. I still say Malone's weak. He caught that detective snooping around, and what does he do? Locks him up. Like he ain't got the balls to just kill him. Shh. Well, don't let his new girl hear that. She'll start swinging that bat of hers at your face until there ain't no face left. Watch out. Oh, watch out, doggy. Oh, no. He's here for the detective. Oh, they got the detective. Okay. We're in the right place. Dog me. This armor's pretty much done. bags on top of the gravestone or something that was pretty cool that is pretty cool damn it I hate it when they open the door why is that thing so loud oh yeah <laughs> my eyes oh I'm hurt I'm hurt I'm hurt I'm hurt I'm hurt good stuff oh You gotta take your time and reload. Gonna rub you out! Just getting warmed up. 
Why the hell would anyone build a vault out of a subway station? This place is like the opposite of airtight. Because they weren't planning to use it, you moron. We used to pull this kind of gun all the time back before the war. Get a bunch of union boys to work some construction job that would go nowhere. Keep everyone on payroll. What was that? Come on, Codsworth. I was sneaking up on you. Get out of the way. You left the dog to fight all by himself? Charles, you better get over there. You got us into a fine mess there, Codsworth. That's a knockout punch right there. Oh no! Guess they wanted the second one. How you doing in there, Valley Guy? Feeling hungry? Want a snack? Keep talking, meathead. It'll give Skinny Malone more time to think about how he's gonna bump you off. Don't give me that crap, Valentine. You know nothing, you got nothing. Really? I saw him writing your name down in that black book of his. Lousy cheating card shark, I think were his exact words. And then he struck the name across three times. Three strikes? In the black book? But I never... Oh, no. I, I, I gotta smooth this over fast. Oh, my God. I missed. I can't believe I missed. This twice. Wow. I got Cosworth, yo. I got Cosworth. Oh, goodness. If I could just get a shot in. If I could just get a shot in. Yo, why don't you get it? Why don't... We did it. We did it, you guys. We did it. Great, great job. We did it. Got three minutes before they realize muscles for brains ain't coming back. Get this door open. Ah, uh, my knight in shining armor. Question is, why does he come all this way and risk life and limb? An old private eye. Whoa. What? What are you? Told you, I'm a detective. Look, I know the skin and the metal parts ain't comforting. But it's not important right now. The only thing that matters is why you went to all this trouble to cut me loose. My son, Sean, is missing. He was kidnapped. But I don't know who took him or where they went. Missing kid, huh? Well, you came to the right man, if not the right place. I've been cooped up in here for weeks. Turns out the runaway daughter I came here to find wasn't kidnapped. She's Skinny Malone's new flame, and she's got a mean streak. Anyway, you got troubles, and I'm glad to help. But now ain't the time. Let's blow this joint. Then we'll talk. This door's on the fritz. Let me see if I can get it open. Good. Hurry up and do that. Just oh, that. Got there we are. Hell of a lot easier to do when the lock isn't on the other side. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Time to dance! <laughs> Nothing. Who's there? Who's looking clear? Skinny Malone and the rest of his boys are waiting for us somewhere. The name's, uh, ironic, but don't let that fool you. Okay, I got it. But I hear big fat footsteps on the other side. Once we step through this door, get ready for anything. Shoot up my guys? You have any idea how much this is gonna set me back? I wouldn't be here if it weren't for your two-timing dame, Skinny. You ought to tell her to write home more often. Oh, poor little.
little Valentine. A shame you got beat up by a girl. I'll just run back home to Daddy, shall I? Should have left that alone, Nikki. This ain't the old neighborhood. In this vault, I'm king of the castle. You hear me? I told you we should have just killed him! But then you had to get all sentimental. All that stupid crap about the old times. Dala, I'm handling this. Skinny Malone's always got things under control. Oh, yeah? Then what's this guy doing here, huh? Valentine must have brought him here to rub us all out. What's the deal with you people and Nick, anyway? Darla's a runaway. Her father wanted me to bring her back home. Turns out she skipped town to be with my old pal Skinny Malone. Mob boss. Never thought he'd manage to scrape together a big enough crew to take over a vault. Guess life's full of surprises. Hey, who's running this show here? You got something to say? Say it to me! You and Nick know each other? <laughs> this troublemaker here used to be a real headache back in the day. Before we got kicked out of the old neighborhood. <laughs> Must have done this dance a hundred times. Enemies are kind of the closest thing you get to friends in these parts. Now quit stalling! You gonna talk? Talk! This is all just a misunderstanding, Skinny. You know that. You let us walk, and we won't come back. You and Nick shot all of my crew, and you expect to just... <sighs> all right. You're lucky I still owe him for that time back in the quarry. I'm gonna give you two until the count of ten, before I forget my good manners and start shooting up the place! What are you doing, Skinny? Kill him! No, Dala. They get one chance to leave. Skinny Malone's putting his foot down. My mother was right. You mobsters are all just talk. We better get out of here fast. One. Two. Three. All right, we'll go, we'll go. We're out of here. Let's go. Five. We'll have to visit him again sometime. Uh, these old school buildings bring me back to when I was a kid in Boston. Hey there. Are you ready to talk? How do you know to find me down in that old vault? Your secretary, Ellie. She sent me. She did? I should give her a raise. Now, you mentioned something about your son, Sean, how he went missing. I want you to come to my office in Diamond City. Give me all the details. Besides, I think you've earned a chance to sit down and clear your head. I'll meet you there. See you in Diamond City.